Hello there. there. I'm Robert. And I'm Vanessa. And we are late to the party, and CinemaCon is occurring right now in Vegas. So a lot of news, a lot of announcements, and things that we're excited to see. And one of them is the upcoming Flash movie starring Michael Keaton. And that's pretty much all we need to know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm excited to see Michael Keaton, you know, uh, take on the Batman once again. And everything else that's going to lead into the future of what is happening in the DC universe. Uh, so, yeah, any little bit more that we can see, we don't need to see more, but any little bit more that they want to show us, we'd happily be open to seeing it. Yes. So, you guys, make sure you check out some of the other reactions on our channel. We have plenty of TV show reactions and movie reactions especially movies of the past with our better late than never series we just did a reaction to oh brother where art thou and we've got arrival coming this throwback thursday so be on the lookout for that but let's get into the newest trailer for the flash now i lost my parents that pain made me who i am Michael? I spent a lifetime trying to right the wrongs of the past. Mm -hmm. As if fighting crime would bring my parents back. Boom! You actually so much did. variety. You look so good! I can't yeah. imagine what you've been through. I love you, Mikey. <laughs> you lost both parents in one day. Harry! I went back in time to save my parents. But instead, I completely broke the universe. <laughs> yeah. As Barry does. You went back and changed the past. This world must die. I like the trailer music. You changed the future. Do you know what this symbol stands for? Hope. It means hope, right? I will help you fight God. Better. Let's get nuts. Let's get nuts. Yeah! <laughs> Damn. I have to undo what I did. These scars we have make us who we are. I'm not meant to go back and fix them. Don't let your tragedy define you. What did you do? Ooh, dang. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's got to die. Oh, no. No. <laughs> oh, I love oh, it. Oh, yeah, the symbol. You're strapped to your parachutes. The wind's yours. He doesn't need one. Oh. <laughs> ah. Nice. <laughs> oh, man. You want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. So he said the thing. I mean, they've given us two of the things that he has said, you know, the I'm Batman. And then, of course, uh, let's get nuts. So I'm sure there'll be others. Checking in there. all the boxes. Right. We see what you're doing, Warner Brothers. But okay. yeah, member berries are plenty. But at the same time, yeah. it's Michael Keaton. And I do love the duality of Ben Affleck as yes. well. So, you know, remembering where you came from and especially when it comes to Keaton and more recently with, you know, the DC world we've been living in for the past decade yeah. and uh, you mean bringing them together i love the symbols too changing and overlapping between the batmans and flash uh we're entering a whole new world now but mm -hmm. you know using the old world to kind of usher us into the new world yeah i like how like in the trailer um when michael keaton's batman is talking he's talking about how like you know his parents like he lost his parents to um kind of like uh meeting barry on that level as well um, and then saying, but you did it, you saved your family. And then, you know, but then there's those consequences that are happening and he's seeing that happen as well. Uh, so I think that like they 
will take that and be able to kind of work together because they both, you know, had those tragedies. Granted, Barry's dad technically didn't die. I love the duality again with Ben Affleck, though, also reaffirming the things that, you know, the Michael Keaton has said. And in fact, maybe Ben Affleck's Bruce Wayne has grown and learned to kind of live with the tragedy, but not let it define you where the Michael Keaton Batman never did get to grow out, out of that and still consistently tried to change the path. So you've got Bruce Wayne of Michael Keaton's world kind of with how Barry feels. And then the Bruce Wayne of Ben Affleck's world that is trying to bring him Accepted into where he it. should be. Yeah. yeah. So I love kind of having that, you know, the devil on each shoulder. Yeah. Uh, but in reality, all all of them will come to the light with the exception of the one Barry that I think is going to lose his ish and cause a lot of trouble in the end because he won't let it go and will not uh, accept loss. That's where he's like, nobody dies. Nobody's going to die. Like he will not let it happen where our Barry is the one that's going to have to bring, hopefully try and bring him to light. Either way, they're probably going to make that one the reverse flash, the other one reverse flash, yeah. um, and change up the story a little bit more than likely. So, And then, of course, Supergirl. Supergirl. Like, I'm really hoping that we're going to get a lot more in the movie because we haven't gotten a lot in the trailers, which I'm okay with. Like, let her shine in the movie so we can come out of the movie saying... That was the biggest takeaway. I'm so glad that they kept it from us. They're dazzling Bruce Wayne in front of us, but I'm hoping Supergirl is the one that everyone's talking about. Yes, but also we have to remind ourselves that this is also a Flash movie, so it's, it's going to be more so on his story. It's true, but at the same time, we don't really want to focus on Flash a whole lot of, you know, know. with what's going on. Yeah. So uh, I think that could be our own bias that's wanting to, you know, see more. Of the other within, characters. Yeah, more because, you know, everything that's going on with Ezra because garbage person. So, uh, but when it comes down to it, I'm sure there's a lot of more surprises. I believe that the critics and the insiders over at CinemaCon are watching it today, I believe is what's going on. Um, so you are going to hear a little bit more, at least of the, the finger on the pulse as to how everybody is uh, feeling about it. But either right. way, we won't know how we feel about it until we lay eyes on it right. mid-June as well. You should as well. Or if you don't want to, that's fine too. But what did you guys think of this trailer for The Flash? Let us know down in the comments below. You can also like and subscribe. And did the thing on our Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Discord. All the social networking gin joints, you know where they are. Cake into the party, fuel the party, keep the party going. On our Patreon, check out those retro reactions on our channel of movies of the past. Plenty to go through. Thanks so much, and as always. Now it's time to say goodbye. This party is over. Bye. Bye.